What's my opening line again? Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> it's wild and country. Oh yeah. <laughs> wild and country for Stampede City Sessions. This week's Wild and Country, we're gonna talk about Megan Patrick. Yeah. She is a boss ass bitch. Whoa, that was strong, but passion's good. She liked when I called her that. She actually came on an interview and I That's called true. her that and she was pretty pumped. I honestly thought she, you were gonna get like, she thought you were gonna get fired next. <laughs> yeah, you just yeah. swore on the radio. <laughs> um, okay, so you remember during the summer when a fan like harassed her on stage yeah. and was like, show me your blank beep. Um, anyways, she was just at the CP train doing a holiday train, such a good cause. A woman threw a Bible at her. <laughs> Yeah, which is crazy. You'd think that if you're reading the Bible, it probably says in there not to throw it at people. Do you not think that? Um, I don't know if it says that in the Bible, I think Christian. it should say that. <laughs> Anyways, she got a Bible thrown at her and she said, she's like, I was so rattled, but I was there for such a good cause that I didn't want to stop. But the girl was like doing gestures at her the entire time and looking at her and she just felt very uncomfortable and I feel bad for her. I'm sorry, Megan Patrick. Yeah, that's crazy. Well, maybe she'll read it and like, you know. No, I'm just saying it's Maybe there. the woman that threw the Bible should read it. Okay, all right. That's my take. <laughs> I like it, Kristen. Okay, Taylor Swift. She's 29 years old, but I think- 10 days older than me. Would all agree <laughs> that she could totally do a great documentary. Oh like, yeah. She's been around for that long. Mm -hmm. Music industry, what, 13, 14 years old. She's teaming up with Netflix. That's exactly what's going down. Yes. It's called Miss America, Anna. Yep. Gonna come out sometime next year. They're gonna premiere it, but they uh, don't have like streaming dates yet for Netflix. But that's gonna, if it's anything like Garth Brooks that just came out through A&E, it's gonna be awesome. Uh, well, it actually is opening Sundance Festival, which is like the biggest yeah. movie, movie premiere, premiere thing. thing? Yeah. I don't even know All what that it is. All that artsy crap. Go Taylor Swift. Yeah. <laughs> and she has permission. Remember she had the big thing with yeah. the X label to use old songs? Scooter Braun. Anyways, name. she got permission they could use those songs now, but you know, she signed a deal. She knew the deal. She has lawyers. I'm just saying they could have held her accountable to that. I gotta say, I would be so sad if I watched that documentary and I didn't get a little, our song and a scrambling screen door, sleeping out late, tapping on our Question, window. what's a scramming what screen door? What's a, what's a scramming screen door? Just it's wondering. a scramming screen door. <laughs> Okay, like you know all the words, yeah. whatever. Mm -hmm. um, and Garth Brooks, obviously we're so pumped that he goes on tour that he like is just a giant name. And he did the dive bar in 2019 and that was his little tour where he went to teeny little dive bars. He gave his audience maybe like, what, 24 hours yeah. notice? Yeah, it was awesome. And be like, show up here, I'm gonna perform in this intimate little venue. He's like, this is so good, we're doing it into 2020 what? as well. They need to do some Canadian dates, we got dive bars everywhere. I know, we have so many dive bars in Calgary. Like, producer Lucas knows. Yeah, he's you a hipster, you know things. Are you the ones doing the stabbing at those dive bars? <laughs> what? No. That's he the just, rumor, watch out for producer Lucas. He just drinks PBR, <laughs> <laughs> that's all he does. <laughs> Anyways, Garth, we're hoping that you come to Calgary because we got a lot of dive bars that we yeah. could, uh, you could call home for a day. Uh, other than that, that's what's wild in country. Go throw a Bible. No, we said don't throw Bibles. <laughs> don't throw Bibles. Not everybody's going to be throwing Bibles. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> pew, pew. <laughs> Can you actually imagine that, though? That's crazy. Yeah. Bible throwing. Somebody should throw it at you. <laughs> Bible. <laughs> Calgary's new country, Wild 95.3.